This man was a black Muslim scholar, yet lived his life as a slave in America. His name was Omar ibn Said, and his story provides us with one of the first innermost narrations of early Muslim history in the United States. Ibn Said has spent two decades studying the Quran in his home of Fruta Torah, modern day Senegal, learning from prominent Muslim scholars. In 1807, after being taken captive by an invading African army, he was sold to slave traders and to never return again. Whilst it is claimed Omar later converted to Christianity, historic experts argue otherwise. His memoir includes an interlist hidden Islamic writings in Arabic beneath the teachings of his white Christian slave masters, alluding that his conversion was a facade. He also opened his memoir with Surah Al-Murq, the 67th chapter of the Quran, declaring God's sovereignty. Umar ibn Sa'id died in 1864, one year before slavery was finally abolished in the US. He was 94 years old.